Hi there. Well, it's officially March, and we're going to go ahead and start off March 1st, 1516, with the print of Erasmus's Novum Instrumentum Monet, or Instrumentum Monet, is actually completed on this day, and is the first published New Testament has been translated into Greek. And in 1562, a bloodbath at Basoi, or Bessé, involves Francis de Gaille, his troops opened fire on the Huguenots. Congregation it is the first event of the wars of religion between Catholics and the Huguenots. And in 1565, Portuguese soldier Estacio de Sá bounds the city of Rio de Janeiro in Brazil. And in 1587, Puritan English parliamentary leader Sir Peter Went is confined in London Tower. In 1591, Pope Gregory the Fourteenth threatens to excommunicate the French King Henry the Fourth. And in 1593, the Uppsala Synod is summoned to confirm the exact forms of the Lutheran Church of Sweden. In 1628, rights are issued in February by Charles I of England, and mandating that every county in England are to pay ship tax. Even if they don't have a port, they still have to pay that tax. And in 1498, March 2nd, Vasco de Gama, his fleet, visits the an island of Mozambique, or Mozambique. And in 1629, the English King Charles I dissolves Parliament against opposition he imprisons nine members of Parliament. And on March 3rd, 1575, Indian Mughal Emperor Akbar defeats a Bengali army at Tu Karoi. And in 1627, Dutch privateer Piet Hein attacks and conquers or captures 22 Portuguese ships the Bay of Salvador off of Brazil. Now, moving on to March 4th, we have 1492, James V of Scotland concludes an alliance with France against England. And this, always, this happens quite often. Kingdoms of Europe ally themselves with each other of course, as usual, France and England ally against each other. They ally themselves with either Spain or the Dutch or Portugal against one another. And in 1522, Anne Boleyn makes her debut or debut at the English court at the Green Castle pageant. And in 1570, King Philip II bans foreign Dutch students from his kingdom. And in 1590, Mertius of Nassau's ship reaches Breda. And in 1611, George Abbott is appointed Archbishop of Canterbury. In 1621, Jakarta, Java, is renamed Batavia. And in 1628, King Charles I grants a royal charter to Massachusetts Bay Colony. And in March 5, 1496, English King Henry VII grants John Cabot, or Giovanni Caboto, a commission to explore the, for new lands. 
and 1528, Utrecht Governor Martin van Rossum plunders the Hague. And in 1558, smoking tobacco is introduced to Europe by Spanish physician Francisco Fernandez. In 1579, Beatue joins the Union of Utrecht. And in 1616, astronomical work De Revolucionos by Nicolas Copernicus is placed on a Catholic forbidden index. And in 1623, the first American temperance law is enacted in the Virginia colony. And in 1624, class-based legislation is passed in the colony of Virginia, exempting the upper class from punishment by whipping. We are on to March 6, 1521, the Portuguese navigator Fernand, Fernand Magellan discovers Guam, an island in the Pacific, one of thousands of islands in the Pacific that were discovered around that time and further on. And in 1579, Balue joins the Union of Utrecht, another state within Europe. And in 1590, the Dutch and English army, led by Maurice of Nassau, captures a heavily fortified or protected city of Breda using a small assault force hidden in a piat or peat. And in 1628, Emperor Ferdinand II delegates restituted edict. And in March 7th, 1530, Christian fleet under Gian Andrea lands on Gerba, North Africa. And in 1573, the Ottomans and Venice sign a peace treaty between each other. And in 1621 of March 7th, John Peter Zun Cohen's troops land on Lantor in the East Indies. And on March 8th, 1531, Henry VIII, recognized as supreme head of the Church of England by convocation of Canterbury. And 1586, Johann van Oldenbarnveldt, or Oldenbarnveldt, becomes the Dutch chief legal advisor. And in 1618, Johannes Kepler discovers the third law of planetary motion. Well, that's it for this week. Well, till next time. Bye.